the mole had been working very hard all the morning spring cleaning his little home. First with brooms, then with dusters, then on ladders and steps and chairs, with a brush and a pail of whitewash, until he had dust in his throat and eyes and splashes of whitewash all over his black fur and an aching back and weary arms. Spring was moving in the air above and in the earth below and around him, penetrating even his dark and lowly little house with its spirit of divine discontent and longing. It was small wonder then that he suddenly flung his brush to the floor and said, bother and a blow and hang spring cleaning and bolted out of the house without even waiting to put on his coat. Something up above was calling him imperiously and he made to the steep little tunnel which answered in his case to the gravelled carriage driveway owned by animals whose residences were nearer to the sun and air. So he scraped and scratched and scrabbled and scrooged and then he scrooged again and scrabbled and scratched and scraped working busily with his little paws and muttering to himself up we go up we go until at last pop his snout came out of the soil into the sunlight and he found himself rolling in the warm grass of the great meadow <laughs>